China has disclosed new technical specifications of its Type 094 nuclear-powered ballistic missile submarine SSBN, revealing significantly upgraded capabilities that suggest the emergence of a new and improved variant within the class. The People's Liberation Army has revealed details of its Type 094 nuclear-powered ballistic missile submarine for the first time, during the Navy's Open Day. The sea-based nuclear deterrent is said to have a submerged displacement of 11,000 tons, maximum speed of 30 knots and can operate at a depth of 400 meters. According to information on display during events to mark the PLA Navy's 76th anniversary last week, the announcement was made during the People's Liberation Army Navy's Open Day on April 23, 2025, and was reported by the South China Morning Post on May 2, 2025. This marks a rare public acknowledgement of the operational performance of one of China's most critical strategic assets. The Type 094 SSBN is now confirmed to have a maximum submerged speed of 30 knots and an operational depth of 400 meters. These figures represent a considerable leap over previous assessments that estimated the submarine's top speed at 20 knots and its maximum operating depth at 300 meters. These upgraded parameters are indicative of a newly constructed or extensively modernized version of the original design rather than a simple retrofit suggesting enhancements to propulsion, hull integrity, and onboard systems. The submarine's propulsion system is a pressurized water-cooled nuclear reactor, which powers a single shaft via a steam turbine arrangement. While specific technical components remain classified, the improvements in submerged speed and stealth performance likely stem from the integration of more modern power plant elements, better vibration dampening, and possibly the use of quieter propeller technologies for pump jet propulsion. These enhancements are critical in reducing acoustic signatures, which are vital for strategic submarines designed to operate undetected in contested waters. Crew composition aboard the Type 094 typically ranges from 120 to 140 personnel, covering all operational domains including navigation, reactor control, weapons deployment, sonar monitoring, and missile operations. A dedicated team manages the strategic missile arsenal, reflecting the platform's primary role in China's nuclear triad. Crew training has been significantly improved in recent years, aligning with the PLA Navy's efforts to ensure continuous at-sea deterrence patrols. The submarine is equipped with 12 JL-2 submarine-launched ballistic missiles, each with an estimated range of 7,000 kilometers. This range allows the submarine to engage targets across the Pacific, including the northeastern United States, from waters near the Chinese mainland. The JL-2 missiles are believed to use inertial navigation systems with satellite-aided corrections via China's Beidou GPS alternative, improving targeting accuracy. While China has not officially confirmed the multiple independently targetable re-entry vehicle capability of the JL-2, it is widely assessed by defense analysts that certain versions of the missile may support this functionality, allowing one missile to deliver multiple nuclear warheads to separate targets. Beyond its nuclear payload, the Type 094 is also fitted with six 533mm torpedo tubes positioned in the forward hull. These provide conventional defensive capabilities and are likely used to launch YU-6 torpedoes, which are wire-guided, high-speed, active-slash-passive homing weapons modeled after the U.S. Navy's MK-48. With a range exceeding 30 kilometers and speeds up to 60 knots, these torpedoes give the SSBN limited anti-submarine warfare and anti-ship capabilities. The submarine may also carry acoustic decoys, sonar countermeasures, and towed array sonar systems to detect threats and evade hostile forces during patrols. Currently, at least six Type 094 submarines are in operational service with the PLA Navy, with most believed to be based at Yulin Naval Base on Hainan Island. The newly revealed specifications suggest that one or more units are of a newly upgraded variant possibly a distinct subclass indicating an evolution in China's undersea deterrent posture. These enhancements reflect China's sustained investment in bolstering the survivability and reach of its sea-based nuclear forces. The decision to release technical information on such a strategic asset is unprecedented and signals a calculated move by Beijing to reinforce the credibility of its naval deterrent. While still limited in scope, the disclosure demonstrates growing confidence in the PLA Navy's submarine force and serves both domestic reassurance and strategic signaling to foreign observers. As part of China's wider military modernization program, the improved Type 094 SSBN underscores Beijing's ambitions to establish a survivable, secure, and technologically advanced second-strike capability, 
further solidifying its role as a major nuclear power with global reach. Posters on display for the open day also said the nuclear submarine had a maximum speed of 30 knots and could operate at a maximum depth of 400 meters. That differs from estimates that the Type 094 had a submerged displacement of 9,000 tons, could travel at 20 knots and operate at a depth of 300 meters. The posters also gave details of the Jean-class submarine size about 135 meters long, 13 meters wide, and with a surface displacement of 8,000 tons. It is the first time China's military has disclosed the specifications of the strategic deterrence submarine since it entered service in 2007, though it was part of naval fleet review ceremonies in 2018 and 2019. The U.S. Department of Defense has said it regards the Type 094 as the first credible sea-based part of China's strategic nuclear triad referring to a military having the ability to launch nuclear weapons from land, sea, and air. The PLA Navy is operating at least six of the Type 094 submarines and is believed to be building more, while also developing a next-generation vessel, the Type 096, according to the Pentagon's latest China military report released in 2024. There has been speculation about when the Type 096 might be built the PLA typically reveals little information about its advanced military hardware until it is near the end of the development stage. The Pentagon report estimated that construction of the Type 096 was likely to begin soon or in the mid-2020s, and that it was expected to enter service in the late 2020s or early 2030s. Unlike attack submarines, which play a key role in aircraft carrier strike groups, ballistic missile submarines are designed for stealth and usually deployed on their own. The submarines do not rely on external oxygen or frequent refueling thanks to the nuclear reactors that power them, so they can remain in the deep ocean for months, on standby to conduct a nuclear strike. The Type 094 is equipped with 12 JL-2 ballistic missiles with nuclear warheads that have a range of about 7,000 kilometers 4,350 miles meaning they could hit the northeast of the United States from waters near the Chinese coast. The latest variation, the Type 094A, which has been in active service since 2020, is reportedly much quieter and carries the more powerful JL-3 ballistic missiles with a range of more than 10,000 kilometers covering almost the entire American mainland from the South China Sea. The Type 096 is likely to carry up to 24 JL-3, and it is expected it will be quieter still, and equipped with more advanced sensors and weapons.